Hey everyone, this is Sam for .NET Latest. <clears throat> Today I'm going to be answering a question from one of our users, and that question is, why do I get question marks instead of Unicode in my SQL Server database? For example, when I want to represent a star in my SQL or in any table, there are times where I get question marks. And um, this is very puzzling to our users. So let's attempt to break this question down. So first of all, what is Unicode? I'm going to go to Wikipedia and let's look at a quick definition of what Unicode is. So essentially, Unicode is just a, a manner or way to represent different text from like all of the different uh, writing systems in the world. So you can have numerous character sets and all of these can be represented in a specific code, which is Unicode. Uh, let's go to unicode-table.com. And so here are some examples of some Unicode characters that can be represented, right? So here is a typical example is a star. Now the U Unicode number for a star is U plus 2605. Okay. Now, let's look at a very simple example to illustrate this. So what I've done here is I've created a simple database called simple blog. This database has one table, which is a post, and um, <clears throat> it has the, the um, following column types. So you have the post ID, which is an integer, the title, which is an mvarchar, the blurb, which is a varchar, and a body, which is an nvarchar. Now, the difference in, in um, column types is essentially varchar um, is used to store ASCII data and should usually be your um, data type of, of preference for normal use. However, so if you want to use any Unicode characters, such as the examples which we saw over here, for example, a star or any of these characters, then essentially you have to use nvarchar. And the reason being that the varchar data type does not support Unicode characters. Um, nvarchar obviously does. And so let's look at a simple example. Obviously, you know, this is just to illustrate uh, the code which I did to set up the table. But here is um, my inst insert statement. What I'm doing is I'm inserting these values, the title, which is post one, um, and the blurb has Unicode characters that I'm inserting into a field of type and var of varchar. So I actually expect these to show me question marks. And uh, the body, uh, which is of n varchar, should show me the star. So let's take a look and see what we have here. All right, so as you can see, um, after inserting into the, the table that I created, because um, the blurb column does not have an nvarchar type, you can see that there, there are question marks inside of the field. Uh, on the other hand, for a column which does support Unicode, that is the nvarchar type, you can see that the characters are um, correctly encoded and I can see them. So to answer the question, why do I get question marks instead of Unicode characters? It's because you're using the wrong column type or the wrong data type um, in your table. You pro probably need to change from varchar to nvarchar.